Hey, you. You're finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Walked right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Damn right. your Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. If they hadn't been looking for you, you could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there. You and me. We shouldn't be here. It's the Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in vines now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him? No, huh? you. Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Oh, Ulfric, shit. The Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader uh, of the rebellion. But if they capture right. you. Oh, God. Where are they taking us? Setting in now, they're bud. where we're going. But Sovereign Guard awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey, what village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Dibella, Kinnereff, Akatosh, Divines, please help me. I'm gonna eat his fucking socks. Look at him. General Tully is the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. More than likely. This is Helgen. Yep. I used to be sweet on a girl from here. Wonder if Vilod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Funny. When I was a boy, Imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. You need to go inside the house. Why? I want to watch the soldiers. Inside the house. Now. Whoa. Yes, Papa. He doesn't Everything understand what's going to happen. Move it! Why are we Fuck stopping? off. Why do you think? End of the line. And there's no well, major go. prison here either. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. No, wait! We're not rebels! Face huh. your death Speak for yourself. Some courage, thief. You've got to tell them! We worked with you! This is a mistake! Step towards the block when we call. One at a time! And loves their list. Stormcloak, y'all. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Raylof of Riverwood. Lokir of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel! You can't do this! Halt! You're not gonna kill me! Archers! Ah! Anyone else feel like ro Wait. You thought at the moment. Step forward. Who are you? You from one of the strongholds, Zork. How did you end up here? Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Forget the list. He goes to the block. You're I a ordered, bitch, Captain. I'm sorry. We'll make sure your remains are returned to Orsinium. Follow the captain, prisoner. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. What was that? It's nothing. Fuck. Carry on. Yes, yeah, it's General nothing. Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend oh, your souls about this. to Ethereus. Blessings of the eight divines upon you. For the love of Talos, shut up and, and let's get this over. Learn our as you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning. 
What are you going to be doing something important after this, My bud? My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. Can you say the same? That's a really nice axe. You Imperial bastards! Justice! Death to the Stormcloaks! As fearless in death as he was in life. All these guys are fucking Nords. Oh, that's fucking racist. There it is again. Did you hear that? I said next prisoner. To the block prisoner. You're gonna be the next nice fucking easy. prisoner if I don't get the fuck out of here. Storm clothes are racist bastards. You really think that? Sentries, what do you see? that thing could the legends be true legends don't burn down villages we need to move now we just need to move <laughs> if you want to stay that way. Gunnar, take care of the boy. I have to find General Tolias and join the defense. God's guide you, Hadbar. Stay close to the wall! <laughs> Quickly, follow me! Okay, you look directly at me and then just start flapping. It's you and me, prisoner. Stay close. Great. Bela, you damn traitor. Out of my way. We're escaping, Hadvar. You're not stopping us this time. Fine. I hope that dragon takes you all to Sovereign Guard! You, come on! Into the keep! With me, prisoner! Let's go! Uh... Fucking goddammit. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. Was that really a dragon? Bring us in the end times? More than likely. We should keep moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. There you go. Take a look around. There should be oh. plenty of gear to choose from. I'm going to see if I can find something for these bones. Got to be a sword or two in one of these chests. Look around. That's my jump button. Got to be a sword or two in one of these chests. Look around. Shut the fuck up, I know. You don't have to repeat yourself See, eight or nine goddamn times. I'm working on it. Got to be a sword or two in one of these chests. Look around. Yes, I see the fucking... Uh, the, I see the magical fucking diamond on my fucking gear. retinas. Sword. 
You better get that armor on. Give that sword a few swings, too. Let's go. Well, not fucking yet. Oh, I don't want to turn that on. Moving. That thing is still out there. Look at me. I look like fucking Christmas. Maybe we can reason with them. What would hold on now? If you want to die, the empire. Salty. See if I can get that door open. Huh? Must have scared him off. Fucking okay. hang on. Oh, that's right. Actually, what did they have? Hang the fuck on, dude. Jesus. Where the hell that is? Let's go. Okay. Fucking God. Doesn't give up easy. There's someone there. What was that? Freedom or sovereign guard! Master! Not the best you know. Here, turn to the stand. I know. I know. Should be like gold bags or something. I remember. No, if I remember correctly, there should be like gold bags and stuff around here. It's been a long time. <gasps> Red. I think I am turning on hardcore mode. Maybe. I don't know yet. Done then. This way. Yeah, I think I'm good. The, the torture room. Gods, I wish we didn't need these. Come on. Do we need these? God damn it.
You fellows happened along just in time. These boys seemed a bit upset at how I'd been entertaining their comrades. Don't you even know what's going on? A dragon is a... Dinalga. A dragon. Please. Don't make up nonsense. Although, come to think of it, I did hear some odd noises coming from over there. Come with us. We need to get out of here. You have no authority over me, boy. Didn't you hear me? I said the keep is under attack. Forget the old man. I'll come with you. Sure. Take all my things. Please. Oh, Round gladly, if you're going to be that much of a dickhead. Fucking ass clown. There's no way Go out on. that way, you know. Not with that fucking attitude. Oblivion are we supposed to go? Where's the way out? Just give me a minute. Let me think. Yeah, I very much think I can. All of you single fucking handedly. See the old man. Good luck, you two. Let's see what this goes. falling behind. A little bit of assistance, please. I'm almost dead. I didn't even realize. Oh. Son of a bitch. That was almost very bad. That's the end of that. What next? Giant snakes. <laughs> no, not in this game. Oh, 
Hold on. There's a bear just ahead. See him? I'd rather not tangle with him right now. I'd be able to see you are. Just take it nice and watch where you stand. Motherfucker, come on. Guess I'm leaving him behind. Yeah. Wait. Looks like he's gone for good this time. But I don't think we should stick around to see if he comes back. Closest town from here is Riverwood. My uncle's the blacksmith there. I'm sure he'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. Closest town from here is Riverwood. My uncle's the blacksmith there. I'm sure he'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. Listen, we should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. We could really use someone like you. And if the rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. Come on. I feel better once we're under cover in Riverwood. Of course. I know, today wasn't the best introduction to the Legion, but I hope you'll give us another chance. The Legion could really use someone like you, especially now. And if the Rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. No, not yet. After all, a dragon, something out of old tales and legends, no one could have expected that. But you can bet he'll be trying to figure it out. This could shift the whole balance of the war. If you want to help stop that dragon, your best bet is to go to Solitude and join up with the Legion. That's fair. Uh, you make a good case. I hope so. The Legion is Skyrim's only hope right now. Come on, we better get moving. See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. When I was a boy, that place always used to give me nightmares. Draugr creeping down the mountain to climb through my window at night. That kind of thing. I admit, I still don't much like the look of it. That's understandable. Guardian stones. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead, see for yourself.
the fuck? How do I level up? Listen, as far as I'm concerned, you've already earned your- Oh, point. I have to sleep to level but up. But until we I get that now. confirmed by General Tullius, just stay clear of other Imperial soldiers and avoid any complications, alright? Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm an orc. I don't think an orc would be joining the Stormcloaks anytime soon. They're a bunch of racist Nords. I don't like the sound of that. That's the end of that. That's the end of that. Damn, that's brutal. I'm glad you decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. <coughs> well, I mean, I was just running this way because... It's the easiest way down the mountain. To be fair. Things look quiet enough here. Come on, there's my uncle. Uncle Halvo, hello. Hadvar, what are you doing here? Are you on leave from Shores, Bones? What happened to you, boy? Shh, Are you in some Uncle, kind please. of trouble? Keep your voice down. I'm fine. But we should go inside to talk. What's going on? And who's this? He's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. Come on, I'll explain everything, but we need to go inside. Okay, okay. Come inside, then. Sigrid will get you something to eat, and you can tell me all about it. What? What is your mother? It was as big as the mountain and black as night. It, it flew right over the barrel. Dragons now, is it? Wait, it's mine. If you keep... <sighs> Ain't every day we get visitors in Riverwood. You need supplies, I Of course. Take, take what you need. But what's all this about? What are you two doing here? Dragon attacked Helgen and destroyed it. Adver, Hadvar and I escaped. What? A dragon? In Helgen? That explains what I saw earlier. Flying down the valley from the south. I was hoping I was wrong about what I thought it was. Ugh. It was a dragon. Hadvar will tell you the same thing. A dragon here in Skyrim. What's One this thing. world coming to? First the war, no, now mind. dragons. Trouble loves company, they say. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt.
across the river and then head north. You'll see it just past the falls. When you get to White Run, just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace. Jarl Balgraf? He rules White Run Hold. A good man, perhaps a bit overcautious, but these are dangerous times. So far, he's managed to stay out of the war. I'm afraid it can't last, though. Which side of the war does I he favor? I don't think he likes either Ulfric or Elisif much. Who can blame him? But I've no doubt he'll prove loyal to the Empire in the end. He's no traitor. Ah, Who's I forget you're new to Skyrim. Jarl Elisif, I should say. Although only because she was married to Jarl Torig when he was murdered. Ulfric murdered Torig, you know. Walked right into his palace in solitude and killed him. Shouted him to death, if you believe the stories. That's what started this whole war. The Empire couldn't ignore that. Once the Jarls start killing each other, we're back to the bad old days. Your I see no harm in it, if you have the skill. The grindstone will improve your weapons. Use the table to improve your armor. If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. Can you tell me about Riverwood? What can you tell me about Riverwood? Gerda's family first settled here as woodcutters a few generations ago. She and Hod run the mill. I make a decent living sharpening axes and fixing the sawmill. What do you think about the war? People are rightly stirred up about the damn Thalmor being allowed to roam around arresting people just for worshipping Talos. But was it worth tearing Skyrim apart and maybe destroying the Empire? No. Ulfric will have a lot to answer for in the end. Nords have always supported the Empire, and the Empire has always been good for Skyrim. So, why are the Thalmor allowed to arrest people for worshipping Talos? It's from that treaty that ended the Great War, remember? When the Emperor was forced by the Thalmor to outlaw Talos' worship. We didn't pay much attention to it when I was a boy. Everyone still had their little shrine. Talos. But then, Ulfric and his sons of Skyrim started agitating about it. Sure enough, the Emperor had to crack down, dragging people off in the middle of the night. One of the main causes of this war, if you ask me. I need to get some sleep. Good day. Sigrid, we have company. That should be better. Hadvar, we've been so worried about you. <sighs> Come, you two must be hungry. Sit down and I'll get you something to eat. Now then, nice. boy. Helgen was destroyed? How did you get away? I don't know where to start. You know I was assigned to General Tully as a scold. We were stopped in Helgen, when we were attacked, by a dragon. When your friend told Don't me, mind me I didn't just believe it at eating all night. of your food. Mara's mercy. A dragon? In Helgen? Why, you could be here at any moment. I'm sure Riverwood will be alright. probably dear. learn how to cook. When the Yara learns what's happened, he's sure to send soldiers. Go on, Hadvar. Let's hear the rest of it. Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. Mass confusion. I don't know if anyone else got out alive. 
I doubt I'd made it out myself if not for my friend here. I need to get back to Solitude and let them know what's happened. I thought you could help us out. Food, supplies, a place to stay. Of course. Any friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. I'm glad to help however I can. Take what you need, my friend. Within reason, of course. May the gods oh, watch God. over your battles, friend. Hadvar, did you really see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? I should probably eat something. Hadvar, did you really see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? You two teeth? make yourselves at home. You're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? It's nice to be back in a friendly spot, huh? Listen, yeah. I'm going to lay up here for a while. You can make your own way to Solitude from here. I'd recommend heading to White Run, just down the road from here. From there, you can take a carriage to Solitude. That sounds nice. I'm um... Feindall thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. You look like a traveler. What? Someone that has seen faraway places and heard new stories. You and Feindall like the same girl? Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood trader to speak with her when I'm not around. He's wasting his time. Yes, two people spending time together never blossoms in a courtship. Is that sarcasm? I've heard better wisecracks from Orgnar. Ah, still you have a point. Camilla letting Feindel visit her isn't a good thing for me. Here, let me give you a particularly venomous letter. Say it's from Feindel. That should get Camilla to stop inviting the elf over. Uh. All right, then. I... That letter ought to convince Camilla to never speak to Feindall ever again. Maybe some other time, but I've got stuff I have to handle. Now, up that way. That's where I came from. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not very good at directions. I 
slept for too long, evidently. I don't have much time for that, unfortunately. Maybe some other time. <sighs> it is killing. Fallsboro, huh? Well... I don't suppose it would hurt. Just to stay there for the night. Scavenge something from it. Have an adventure. We want to fight today. <laughs> Anyone else? I don't think I got lost at all. It's close enough. You're lost. That's close enough. I'm warning you. May as well be. Uh, no. 
Right. Found you. Not quite good enough, are you? Regain myself. 